a room here and um, I've put a little platform in front of the wall texture that I imported. Um, and I want to put a table into this room. So I've created the new table. And I did it based on this table here. Um, Alt E. I see that table right here. So what I did was I went to domains. I took the top of the table, which and I then went add domain. And that copied all the qualities of that top of the table to this one, which was the new one that I created. Then I put in the walls, making sure that the front was all that new domain number, which was 46. Okay, I can always right click on that domain to see the domain number, which is 46. So I made sure all those walls were 46. I made sure all my wall textures were matching this wall textures. So there's a couple things to check when you're doing that. And then I, I did the, um, the bottom piece. And this was the new domain of the base. I did it here, smaller, but still I used, I clicked on that domain. Let me show you again real quick. I click on the domain, I put add domain. I make sure the properties all look good. It shows me the new domain. And then I put in my walls. So when I go over to walls and I click here, let's zoom in a little bit. I'm probably gonna see that that's 37V and that's 37V point, okay. So the point being, I've created two new R boxes, one which will sit on top of the other, and I'm gonna move them into the other room. So here's X, let me go back to domains. I right click on this guy, the big one. I'm gonna drag it over toward the, my new wall. I'm gonna right click here, move that over, use my right click, uh, and now I'm going to right click on that domain and drag it in and right click on this domain and drag it in. And let me see if I can get it to the center of that table. Let me Z in a little so you can see what I'm doing. In order to get to the center of that table, I'm going to have to go down to a scale of 32. I am now at 64. I'm going to go to 32 and I will but I don't want that table to be right there. I think I want it to be here. Okay, so I've got my tabletop on top of the base and um, I am now going to say save and enter and then left click load and enter. And then I go Alt E. And here we go. And here is the table.